Today, we're exploring how far humanity has traveled into the cosmos and what exciting destinations lie ahead. Buckle up as we take a look at how far humans can travel into space, how we got there, and where we're heading in the future. Let's dive in. Our story begins in the late 1950s, when the space race between the United States and the Soviet Union sparked the first human forays into space. The launch of Sputnik by the Soviet Union in 1957 marked humanity's first step into the final frontier. This metallic sphere, just 58 centimeters in diameter, signaled the dawn of a new era, capturing the world's imagination. It orbited Earth, sending back simple radio signals that could be received by anyone with the right equipment. A beep, beep, beep that echoed through history. In 1961, Yuri Gagarin became the first human to orbit Earth, breaking new ground for human space travel. His 108-minute flight aboard Vostok 1 was a milestone, showing that humans could survive and function in space. Gagarin's flight was a triumph of Soviet engineering and a testament to the bravery of the cosmonaut who boldly ventured where no human had gone before. In 1969, Apollo 11 achieved the seemingly impossible landing humans on the moon. Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin took their historic steps, making the moon the furthest point humans had ever traveled. One small step for man, one giant leap for mankind, indeed. This achievement set the stage for future space exploration and established a foundation for human dreams beyond Earth. Apollo missions continued, with a total of six successful moon landings, each contributing to our understanding of lunar science and the potential for human habitation. Fast forward to today, and our reach into space has grown significantly. The International Space Station, ISS, has been our primary destination for over two decades. Orbiting about 400 kilometers or 250 miles above Earth, it serves as a hub for scientific research and international cooperation. It's a marvel of human engineering and collaboration, with astronauts from different nations working together in microgravity. The ISS has been instrumental in studying the effects of long-term spaceflight on the human body, conducting experiments that benefit life on Earth, and preparing us for future deep space missions. NASA's Artemis program aims to return humans to the moon. In 2022, Artemis First, an uncrewed mission, successfully tested the Space Launch System, SLS, and the Orion spacecraft, paving the way for crewed missions. The SLS is the most powerful rocket ever built, capable of sending astronauts farther than ever before. Orion, with its state-of-the-art systems, is designed to sustain astronauts for extended missions, providing the safety and reliability needed for deep space exploration. SpaceX-2 is pushing the boundaries with its Starship spacecraft, designed for deep space travel. With these advancements, the Moon remains our current furthest reachable destination, with plans to land astronauts there by 2025. Starship's fully reusable design and unprecedented payload capacity promise to revolutionize space travel, making journeys to the Moon and beyond more feasible and sustainable. Next up is Mars. NASA plans to send astronauts to Mars in the 2030s. The Artemis missions will help us prepare for these longer journeys by testing life support systems and other technologies needed for deep space travel. Mars, our neighboring planet, offers a tantalizing glimpse into the potential for human colonization beyond Earth. Its surface conditions, while harsh, are the most Earth-like in the solar system, with a day similar in length to ours and the presence of seasons. SpaceX is at the forefront with its ambitious plans to colonize Mars. The Starship, designed for interplanetary travel, aims to carry large numbers of astronauts and cargo to the Red Planet, potentially starting in the 2030s. Elon Musk's vision of a self-sustaining city on Mars drives these efforts, highlighting the possibilities of making humanity a multi-planetary species. Mars colonization involves challenges such as growing food in Martian soil, generating power, and creating habitats that can protect against radiation and extreme temperatures. International and commercial collaborations are vital to these endeavors. The advancements in technology are what make these missions possible. NASA's SLS and Orion spacecraft are key components for deep space exploration, providing the power and safety needed for long-duration missions. The Orion spacecraft, with its advanced life support systems and robust design, is built to endure the harsh conditions of deep space. Its European service module supplies propulsion, power, and life support, showcasing international cooperation at its best. SpaceX's Starship, with its reusable design and massive payload capacity, is a game-changer for reaching Mars and beyond. Blue Origin's New Glenn rocket and Blue Moon lander also promise to expand our capabilities. These innovations in rocket and spacecraft technology are lowering the cost of access to space and increasing the frequency of missions. Reusability is a key factor in making space travel more economical and sustainable, reducing the cost of each launch and allowing for rapid turnaround times. Global cooperation is more important than ever. The Artemis Accords, signed by multiple countries, aim to establish a framework for peaceful and cooperative lunar exploration. These partnerships will help us achieve our goals more effectively and sustainably. By working together, we can ensure that space exploration benefits all of humanity, fostering peace and collaboration in this new frontier. 
The Accords outline principles for transparency, interoperability, and the responsible use of space resources, setting the stage for a cooperative and ethical approach to space exploration. While the Moon and Mars are our immediate targets, the dream of interstellar travel lingers in the minds of scientists and visionaries alike. The distances to even the nearest stars are mind-boggling, but that hasn't stopped us from imagining the possibilities. One concept is the Breakthrough Starshot Initiative, which aims to send tiny, light-propelled spacecraft to Alpha Centauri, our nearest star system, located about 4.37 light-years away. These spacecraft, called starships, would travel at a significant fraction of the speed of light, reaching Alpha Centauri in just over 20 years. It's a bold idea that could revolutionize our understanding of interstellar travel and the potential for finding life beyond our solar system. Starships would be propelled by powerful lasers, zipping through space at unprecedented speeds, carrying miniaturized instruments to capture data and images from this distant star system. Closer to home, the exploration of the outer planets and their moons continues to captivate scientists. Missions like Europa Clipper and Dragonfly aim to explore the icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn, respectively. Europa, with its subsurface ocean, and Titan, with its thick atmosphere and surface lakes of methane, are prime candidates in the search for extraterrestrial life. These missions will probe the mysteries of these intriguing worlds, searching for signs of life and studying their unique environments. While the prospects of future space travel are exhilarating, the challenges are formidable. The harsh environment of space, with its radiation, microgravity, and isolation, poses significant risks to human health. Long-duration missions require robust life support systems, radiation shielding, and psychological support to ensure the well-being of astronauts. Scientists are studying the effects of space travel on the human body, from muscle atrophy to changes in vision, to develop countermeasures that will keep astronauts healthy during extended missions. Technological hurdles, such as propulsion systems capable of reaching distant targets, efficient life support systems, and sustainable habitats must be overcome. Innovations in artificial intelligence, robotics, and materials science will play critical roles in addressing these challenges. For example, AI can assist with autonomous navigation and decision-making, while advanced robotics can perform complex tasks in space environments, reducing the need for human intervention. Moreover, the ethical and legal implications of space exploration cannot be overlooked. The Artemis Accords and other international agreements aim to ensure that space remains a realm of peaceful exploration and cooperation. As we venture further into space, it is imperative to address issues such as space debris, planetary protection, and the equitable sharing of resources. Space debris, in particular, poses a growing threat to satellites and space stations, necessitating international cooperation to mitigate and manage this risk. As we stand on the brink of a new era in space exploration, the possibilities are truly limitless. From the moon to Mars and beyond, humanity's journey into space is just beginning. The next decade promises to be one of the most exciting periods in space history. Our quest to explore the cosmos is driven by a fundamental human desire to understand our place in the universe. Each mission, each step forward, brings us closer to answering profound questions about the origins of life, the potential for living on other worlds, and the nature of the universe itself. The pursuit of knowledge and the spirit of adventure fuel our endeavors, pushing the boundaries of what is possible.